Hi guys, this is tabletnews.com and after showing you the Asus VivoTab RT, we have the Asus VivoTab Smart for you. A pretty interesting tablet, this time with Windows 8, not Windows RT. This model is only $499 and that means you're getting a 64GB tablet for that, so that's why we're very interested in this tablet. So we got the white version of the Asus VivoTab Smart right here with Windows 8. Um, it packs 64GB of storage, Intel Atom Dual Core CPU and a bunch of interesting technologies we're going to learn about soon but first the unboxing. So inside the box we have the tablet, we got this charger available right here and then comes the bunch of manuals. Here we go. This user guide for Windows 8 to get started with all the gestures and stuff and then there is a detail of the warranty card and finally the user manual for this particular tablet and last but not least the little cleanup cloth for the screen and finally we've got this USB cable for the tablet time to start up the device see what it's all about see what it can do for one thing, it's a bit thicker and heavier than the Asus VivoTab RT. Well, it should be actually. It's 9.7 millimeters in thickness, so it's about one millimeter and a half thicker, and it weighs 580 grams. It's not that heavy after all. We've got the on-off button right here on the upper left, keeping it pressed, and it should boot up right now. So, as I said, we tested the Asus VivoTab RT with Windows RT. There's also the Asus VivoTab. Um, Windows 8 version out there and there's this Asus VivoTap Smart version with an Intel Atom Dual Core 1.8 GHz CPU seems to work just fine for this uh, initial boot in the review the system is pretty much the same with the charm bar right here with the system of closing down an app simply by swiping from the top to the bottom and also the system of uh, opening stuff up like a store and map and switching between them like this let's close once again the stuff up and let's see how we're doing in the settings area notifications screen and connectivity let's connect to a Wi-Fi router and enter tablet news to see how the web browser is doing you must know about this tablet that at the back it has an 8 megapixel camera so this is the 8 megapixel camera with LED flash and a 5 element lens this crisp and bright display is as usual from ASUS an IPS screen it's a 10.1 inch IPS screen um, the resolution is 1366 over 768 pixels and the device also comes with Sonic Master audio technology and NFC plus there's a 2 megapixel front camera available right here at the top 2 GB of RAM and 64 GB of storage as well as a micro HDMI port right here micro SD card slot right here and uh, we also get 32 GB of ASUS web storage in the cloud for about 3 years Bluetooth 4.0 and the camera at the back is able to do full HD capture let's enter it just for curiosity sake so here's the camera so it does full HD capture this 8 megapixel camera it's got a BSI sensor and the interface is pretty much the same as the one we saw on the first ASUS VivoTab RT we also have a gyroscope, G sensor, compass we can play with the folders from the normal desktop view tap them like this and just for the sake of checking out the, the screen quality we're going to view a picture zoom it in just to check out the screen quality of course after uh, this little unboxing we're going to test the video playback of the tablet we're going to do some filming with the camera run some apps run some games and for now let's enter the Windows Store see its interface here we are clean interface working smoothly very bright display as you can see and very bright colors and I apparently seem to have Chrome installed, so I'm going to use Chrome and the tablet news. This is the split version of the keyboard with a numeric pad in the center. So let's enter tablet news. Here we are, tabletnews.com, loaded very fast. Chrome on Windows 8 seems to be really good. Pinch to zoom. 
doesn't work in this version this is the chrome for desktop version it's not the chrome for metro which we're actually waiting for and looking forward to test and i also seem to have some interesting games here but more about that later we have winamp we have photoshop we have a lot to play with on this tablet so asus vivotap smart it costs 499 dollars it offers you 64 gigabytes of storage chrome for now there's also Word 2010 to play with with all the classic options available and that's all we can say about this device right now but we'll be back with more info soon in a full review for now it looks promising the screen is bright and crisp the camera also promises good things we have a lot of storage and the ability to use the full windows experience on this device meaning we can install and play the best games out there this is tabletnews.com, hope you like this unboxing and short preview of the tablet. We'll be back with more in the following days and a full review. Bye bye.